Hello folks, in this video we're going to look at some of the tool handling improvements that we've made in Gaffer 56. Uh, specifically the use of shift and control to change the rate of interaction when you're using the mouse. So here we can see in the viewer when you're tumbling around, uh, if you hold down shift whilst the key is held, you then have much finer and more precise range of movements. This can be particularly useful when you have the camera move tool enabled and you're looking through a uh, light to aim it, holding down shift uh, lets you be a lot more subtle and a lot more precise in your movements. The second area of improvements here are when you use the scroll wheel, and this is actually true of all views that use the scroll wheel. If you hold the shift key down, you can see we then navigate in uh, much smaller increments. Again, quite useful if you're dollying uh, your camera uh, for positioning reasons. Uh, previously, uh, you may have used the precise mode when working with a tool handle. Uh, we've improved this behavior so when you press it, it no longer snap snaps back to the origin. Uh, a quick refresh if you haven't seen those before is that holding down shift enables precise mode uh, so you get smaller increments. Uh, holding down control uh, snaps to a grid which is default multiples of 1 for uh, scale and translate and 30 degrees for rotate. Holding down shift and control then gives you 10 times smaller grids. So in this case, it's increments of 0.1. And this works with all of, all of the different tool handles. So translate, rotate has the same thing. If you hold down shift, you can see that we're moving in more precise regions. So hopefully that can be helpful when you're trying to get things in the right place.